Like, it's always the dusty, rusty, crusty. Having a conversation with me, like, he's like flirting with me. There we go with the lighting. Hi, everybody. You want to get in the vlog? Yeah. All right, he acts a little stink right now. I don't know. But good morning, everybody. It's actually like nine something. Uh, no, it's 10.04 right now. Good morning. Today is Saturday, just to give you guys a little reference. But today we're going, my family and I are going to support my brother at his first home game at LIU. You guys can't see my shirt. There you go. But um, we are super excited, and I wanted to take you guys with me on this day. This morning was a bit hectic. I woke up at like 8 and I had to like shower and everything and I wanted to do like a little bit of makeup. It turned out as like a beat face with these really big lashes. I love these lashes though. Anyway, <laughs> we are on the road right now. We were stopping. We're at the store right now currently to um, get some water just for like the road because like the drive from our house is like an hour and a half to two hours give or take. So um, we're going to do that. But I just wanted to come on here and introduce this vlog to you guys so you guys just like know because... I feel like my vlogs just always start off with like doing something without me like talking to you guys. So I actually want to give you guys a background and content as to what this video is going to be about. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, comment and share it, please. So yeah, so expect more videos like this from me, especially with my brother having like a few home games this season. So I'm super pumped and thank you so much. If you've been on this journey with me i know i've been so inconsistent with youtube and i'm really trying i just i go through phases where i'm motivated i'm motivated and that's just what it is i, I don't want to make excuses so i'm just telling you guys no thank you guys so much and i can't wait to show you guys what this day brings so besitos Sunday, October 9th, and yeah, I know I'm always I'm always running late, but um, I'm going to I have to pick up my niece's gift from the children's place. I bought her some clothes, and I think I messed up the order. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, it's like three o'clock, and I was been supposed to be there, even though my sister doesn't start on time. I don't know what time the party start. But I text my mom like at 1 o'clock. I was like, did the party start? And she was like, no. So I was like, all right. I literally got up and started getting ready at 1 o'clock. Ciao. Anyway. I'm going to be wearing my, um, my Nano. 
Louis Vuitton. So I'm going to just put my lip products in here. Maybe not that one because I don't want that to spill in my bag. Y'all yeah, know I got to go with my favorite, Gucci Guilty. Like this perfume smells so good. Let me stop playing around and let me actually get going. Ooh. So I'll see you guys when I get in the car. Y'all. All right, y'all. Let me tell y'all what happened. So I get to the place, the children's place, and I brought my niece some, some stuff for her birthday today, and I brought my nephew some stuff for his birthday, which is at the end of the month of October. And I had put the settings, child, I'm driving, and I, I didn't have time to put this up on my dashboard because I'm rushing. And I'm not going to get down there until 5.20 now because I spent 15 minutes in the store trying to, like, figure out what happened to my order. So I placed my order yesterday on the 8th online. And my niece stuff, I placed, um, I had put, like, the settings to pick up in store to the nearest store that was closest to me. And then the rest of the stuff, which is my nephew stuff that I brought for his birthday later in the month, I had it shipped to the store. But what happened was, I think everything just put shipped to the store from their warehouse, and they couldn't find my order. And I'm like, the girl's like taking forever. I spent 15 minutes in there. It was just like searching. And they said that they had uh, rebooted the system just to make sure that they didn't miss anything. And I'm like, oh my God. So I just had to like buy her stuff again and then when my stuff comes from being shipped from the warehouse I will they'll just refund me which is which is fine but I'm like I can't come to the birthday party empty-handed I'm like of course me though but everything happens for a reason and I'm here I'm on the road now and it's 346 a little later than what I wanted to be on the road but it's fine I just had to tell you that because I'm like oh my god like <laughs> Of course me, I would have to buy it, everything twice. Not everything, just her stuff. Which I think it came up to like, I don't know, $70 or something like that. So not that bad, under 100 And I got her three pairs of shirts and three pairs of jeans. Because it's starting to get like cold out. And I want her to have some clothes. So yeah, I'm going to see y'all when I get to my sister's house. It's like an hour and 33 minutes. So yeah, and tomorrow is a holiday. So that many people shouldn't be on the road so yeah i'll see you guys later because my arm getting tired with just standing like this <laughs> all right i'm also at a red light right now but i am so hungry i didn't eat anything since i like started to get ready i'm just like need to be at the birthday party like i feel so late i feel like one of those aunties who's just like girl like get it together like get it together so i had to make a quick stop to get gas I got y'all on my dashboard now it wanted to cooperate today so there's that but yeah now I'm back on the road I still got an hour and 22 minutes left and I need to put on my seatbelt because <laughs> I forgot to put it back on when I took it off trying to put this camera on my dashboard but yeah, I wanna Prime Day is coming up and I wanna get the um a new like mount for my camera for my car. I wanna get the one that sticks to actually my windshield. Stop sign. Then at the next one, turn right. But yeah, child, I'm not gonna get down there until 5 30. Which I mean it's okay. I just hope the food is done by then. Okay? All right, so let me really focus and stop trying to record. Lane to take a slight right turn. And I'm going to see y'all. Right turn onto US 1 South. When I get to my sister house, for real this time. You see in the light, you're trying to play me. I got to go. <laughs> yeah, you birthday? Come here, it's your birthday? Dirty South, uh, 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 can y'all really feel me? Feel me. East Coast, feel me, feel me. West Coast, feel me. Say what? Dirty South, uh, here we go. Y'all, I finally made it. And I'm eating because y'all already know I was hungry. Dirty East Coast, feel me. Say what? West Coast, feel me. Dirty South, dirty, dirty. Can y'all really feel me? I got me in the East Coast, feel me. West Coast, feel me.
I just got in. It's like 9.20. It took me like almost two hours. It really, it's like an hour and a half, but yeah, I get it. So I never showed you my outfit, but I just wore this jacket that I love. It's like the Mugler inspired. The Mugler one is like, I don't know, $800. This is, this is not that one. <laughs> then I'm wearing my Speedy Nano. Then I'm just wearing this top from Fashion Nova. And then my jeans are um, Hollister, I think, or Fashion Nova. And then my shoes are from Lola Boutique. But yeah, y'all. Let me tell y'all this story. I was driving to my sister's house, as y'all know. And this cop <laughs> pulls me over. So I was driving in the far left lane. And I was going 60. And the speed limit was 65. So I guess I was going too slow. And he was behind me for like a really long time. For like at least four miles. So I'm like, why is this guy like sitting behind me so he finally pulls me over so i get over <laughs> on the right has to drive all the way on the right side of the lane and then he's like he comes to my car i hand him like my license and registration and then he's like like having a conversation with me like he's like flirting with me i'm like he's like oh where you going um how's your license and he's like walking around my car just to kind of like make conversation again and i'm like you know i'm not worried like my paperwork is all good so i'm like here you go sir um and then he's like, he sees my camera was on my dashboard and it wasn't on, it was off and I had like the, the cover on it, on the on the lid. And he was like, oh, you do you do YouTube, something like that? And I was like, yeah, I'm a content creator. And he was like, oh, are you famous? I'm like, famous? Like, no, I'm not famous. And he was like, I was like, that's the goal. And he was like, yeah, okay. So he just took my stuff and then he gave me a warning, but then he ripped it up. I'm telling the story to them. He gave me a warning. I don't know why he even print this, but um, 
just a warning and then he ripped it up before he gave it to me he was like don't worry about it it was just a warning and I was like okay and he was like just be careful next time little flirt and I'm like why didn't you just ask me for my number I didn't say that to him but in my head I'm like why you ain't ask me for my number like anyway I'm glad that pretty privilege <laughs> is a thing because I feel like if I did it if I wasn't like all of this he would have definitely given me a ticket so yeah I just had to come in here and tell you guys that but yeah, I'm home now. I need to edit Vlogtober week one because today's Sunday. I told you guys, Sundays is when my Vlogtober um, vlog is going to go up for the week. So I need to finish editing that and then knock out. Tomorrow's a holiday, so I don't have to wake up early, thank God. But I still got to do some work. So I'll talk to you guys later and I hope you guys enjoy this vlog and the rest of the days for October. I'm in my grandma suit. It's like one o'clock. I thought I I did have a eyelash appointment like I was telling you guys yesterday. Um, but my lash tech she had um she had to go get her braces off and she didn't know how long they were gonna take. So I just told her like don't worry about it. Just call me after. And then she also has a client at three and I'm getting a volume set which just takes like two hours. So she was like, I don't want to rush with you, so you just want to come after my 3 o'clock client. And I was like, yeah, because I don't want you to rush on me either. So, yeah, I'm home now. I went to the bank. And I'm sorry, my arm is getting tired. I need to buy a new lens for this camera. But anyway, off topic. Um, I'm home now. I need to edit because Vlogtober week one still hasn't gotten up. Listen, yeah, last night, y'all, Sunday, I was just so tired and... I was supposed to post the vlog yesterday on Sunday, but I was just tired. But it's gonna it's gonna definitely go up today, like for real for real. By the time y'all see this video, Vlogtober week one is already gonna be up, but I feel like I just have to update you guys. So that's it. Let me get to editing because I keep talking and the video was like an hour long. I was like, wow, I don't think any of my, my videos are an hour, but I need to still like cut it down. There's a lot more I still need to edit, so let me get to going. And I'll see you guys later when I go to get my lashes. So that's like around probably like five, which works for me. So yeah. So it's 4.05 and I'm heading off to my eyelash appointment. My appointment is at 4.45 so I'm going to drive there now. It takes me like 20 minutes just so I'm not rushing. So I'll see y'all when I get there. Hey y'all, so I'm here. I'm at Brianna's house waiting to get my, um, my lash done. It's 4.40 and I'm about to walk in in like 3 minutes just because she told me to come at 4.45. So I like to be precise on time. Um, but yeah, I just felt like let me take out the camera to update you guys. It's real nice outside. I don't know why around this time, like 5 o'clock, I start to get like sleepy. Like I'm ready for a nap, which is so bad because I need to start working out. I would say like often, maybe like every other day, like around this time, I start to get sleepy. And I want me a nap and that's not good like at all. So I need to start going to the gym just to get my body a little bit more active than what it already is. So yeah. If you guys know of any supplements or like some, um, I need to take start taking vitamins again. So if you guys have any recommendations as to what should I take, let me know. Leave a comment. And make sure you all comment because I don't be getting no comments on my videos. That's rude. Except for one person or two people, like one or two people. But leave a comment. Talk to me, okay? I'm a regular person. <laughs> but yeah, I'll see y'all when I get inside. So now we're about to go out to eat, so I'll see y'all there. 
No, no. No? No, no listo, sí. No, listo. Sí. Ok. Está bien. On a scale of one to ten, how to food? Mm, I'll give them like a like eight. Okay. And was it worth twenty five dollars? Hey y'all! So I got a package this from Shein. I got a few stuff, so I wanted to come in here and share what I got. But I just got home and I need to get in the shower and stuff because that's what I like to do as soon as I get home and but yeah I'm gonna come and show you I look a mess okay I look a mess but my lashes look so good like my girl really be snapping like for real she be like you and your long eyelashes like yes I need the minx on okay I don't like no short little baby eyelashes I like if I'm gonna get eyelash extensions I'm gonna get extensions okay period the next day hey y'all so it's 10 19 like y'all just seen i'm headed out the door and i'm a little bit late because i need to go get my car inspected sorry if you hear noise outside that's like my next door neighbor's motorcycle but yeah he just left anyway i have to go get my car inspected i should have woke up at eight but i woke up at nine instead so i'm just not leaving out the house but let me get going i'm wearing this like north face jacket a regular black tee with these like blue leggings that I got from Shein. So yeah, I'm just gonna throw on some shoes and quickly run out the door and make sure I get my wallet. So yeah. Y'all. This line is so long, like, and it keeps going. And like, I don't know if y'all can see it over there, but dang, I should have came a little earlier. I was gonna put y'all up on my dashboard, but my battery about to die and my proof of insurance is really on my phone, so I hope that they don't say anything because of that. But yeah, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna be in this line for a while. Hopefully it goes by fast, but I'm probably not gonna leave here until like another like hour and a half to two hours. So I might as well get comfortable. But yeah, I didn't even see that my battery was dying. That's crazy. I see how when I get home or when I get to Alta, I might vlog in there, but I just have to get one thing or two things. I have to get two toners. But yeah, so I'll see y'all later. Alright y'all, so I'm just now leaving the car inspection place, the DMV. And somebody told me that my tire is flat in my um, on my left hand side in the back. On my right hand side in the back. And I have to go to um, quick check or some quick check to like put some air in it. I was wondering like what's that sound because I what I did hear something but I'm like what is that sound? What is that sound? And I didn't know. So yeah, I'm gonna have to go to the quick check and find somebody to help me because I really don't know how to put air in my tire. So I'm gonna just go up there and ask a really cute man or just any man of that matter. And um, somebody gonna say yes to me. Somebody better say yes to me. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna go do that. And then hopefully I can go to Alta. If not, then I'm just gonna have to wait until my mom gets home. But I'm sure a nice man or, or somebody could help me, like. All right, y'all, so I tried to go to two different quick checks now and um, like their air thing isn't working. So I come across the street to like this regular gas station. I don't even know the brand, but there's this ugly, ugly man up there. I don't know if you can see him. Him right there. He talking about some I go up to him to ask him for help for to put air in my tire. I'm a, I'm a pay for it because over here it's like a dollar fifty, a fucking scam. So he talking about some oh we don't do that. You gotta go to your mechanic. I said boy hush. Talking about some damn mechanic. Like it's always the oh my god oh my god. Like it's always the dusty, rusty, crusty as men. 
talking about some mechanic boy nothing nobody said nothing about no mechanic like i said ear in my tire if you ain't want to help just say that ugly all right y'all it's 12 20 i'm back home and i made me something a little like something to eat a little breakfast thing because i'm not too hungry but i didn't eat any breakfast so i'm gonna have this some yogurt and some y'all i've been loving these body butter things i think i showed y'all this before these body butter this is black owned um, i got this from this girl my mom knows her anyway y'all need to try this like i finished the bottle this thing is empty like empty empty and i be trying to like scrape <laughs> but my mom and i we support her and we bought a few so this flavor is mango butter and they smell so good y'all like so 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 good i wish i could smell this but it looks like this is so creamy and when it goes into your skin it's like not um super like um you know when you put lotion or like oil on your skin it, be, it gives you that like weird consistency after but this is gives you a nice glow y'all see it and and it's so hydrating so make sure y'all go support i'm gonna leave her um information in the description box below but i'm serious like i y'all need these especially in the winter time make sure you wear lotion under your clothes in the winter time because if not it's not it especially if you dark skin like that's not cute make sure y'all go pick up some of these okay this is not sponsored she's not paying me i just really love these and i use them so yeah but hey y'all so i showed my um when i got a shein package like it's been sitting here for like two days now and it's like super late it's like two something in the morning and i just i can't sleep so i was just like you know what i have the urge to open up my package so that's what i'm gonna do right now yeah i know the situation with me and packages i don't like to touch packages because i don't like to get my hands dirty and right now i just wash my hands because i just got done from using the bathroom so yeah we're gonna put these gloves on and then open them because I kind of forgot what I got in the in these in the package in the Shein like all my items. I got like a, this black jacket, and it's not super like heavy. It's really light. Yeah. Okay, this is cute. I like the way it looks on I me. Mean. This is a size medium too because I just wanted something that was a little bit more like baggier on me. Um, so my typical size is a small but I just wanted something a little bit bigger and this is a medium. So I'll leave everything linked down in the description box below because that's how I do. And also make sure to subscribe if you aren't subscribed. But yes y'all I'm still in my bonnet because I told y'all it's so late and I just wanted to open up my packages. I'm not going to show everything tonight because in the morning when I like get myself put together, I'm like, you know, give y'all a real haul, but so, oh, I got these black jeans. Yeah, these are cute. Want these. And I got these in a small, I think. I should have got these in an the extra small. Um. I do like these. Yeah, these are cute. I hope y'all can see them, but yeah. These are real cute. This is another pair of jeans that I got, y'all. And this is in an extra small. I don't know if y'all can see it, but this is how I like my jeans to fit. Like, you see how they just fit really snug? Not too, too tight, but just comfortable. Make your butt looks big. Let me see, because I don't know if y'all can see it right here. Hello, this has a pair of jeans look on me. Please ignore the stuff on the floor. But yeah. Ignore the stuff on the floor. These are how these jeans fit on me. I love these jeans. And I'll have, every, again, everything linked down below. These jeans come up to above my ankle, but I already knew that. I just wanted to wear these for, um, just for the style of it. Like, they give me, like, cargo vibes, but in a jean version, if that makes sense. Like, they remind me of cargo pants, but just jeans or denim. 
glad I went with my instant because the reviews were saying to get a small but I'm like no no let me get a, um, an extra small so I'm glad I trusted my my gut yeah so this is the last pair of jeans that I got I think I got these in a small because I could take them in like right here I'm probably gonna get them like cinched in right here just so they could be like the perfect fit and I know this looks like a little but this difference is just it'll make a it'll make a big difference with how the jeans just fit more snug like I told y'all I'm a pretty slim girl for the most part like you know what I mean so I like my clothes to fit very properly because if not like I don't like anything out of shape and like it's not much of a difference but I think I'm still would benefit from just it being tighter here um, so yeah so these are these are the stacked jeans I don't know if you guys can see it come out super duper long and these I could just wear with some like really nice boots that'll go over the jeans so that you know it can go over very nicely I would show y'all in this mirror but I have everything on this floor and it looks a mess I wish I could just do the waist thing by myself but whatever it's not the it's not it's not a big deal but I do really like these fit very nice comfortable again you don't see like it bulky right here um, so yeah I really like these y'all and I like the color too like looks like a light wash so here is one of the tops that I got I love this top like it's so cute I got this in an extra small because I don't have big breasts I'm a size 34 to 36 B with my breasts and I love it y'all like trying to give y'all a more closer up look and you still got a little bit of space I personally wanted this to fit tight so that it could like you know just feel comfortable again for me that's how I like to wear my clothes not super tight where it's uncomfortable like but just tight enough um so yeah this is how the top looks on me here's how the back looks I love it I love it it looks so good and yeah so I got this top in a few different colors but I just specifically like the way white looks on me uh, when I get dressed up and I go out and stuff so I thought this would be the first one that I try on and I've read such good reviews the girls was like you need this so I was like okay I gotta get it period but yeah I'm sorry I'm not showing my face I'm gonna show my face tomorrow when I get everything situated and I look more put together because I told y'all it's like almost three it's almost like three o'clock in the morning at the time that I'm not filming this so I'm gonna do the other stuff in the morning because now I'm tired <laughs> and I just showed y'all like a few pieces so I'm gonna try to get to go to bed now but yeah I'll see y'all in the morning all right yeah so I'm back with my finishing the rest of my haul from Shein this is the um a few hours later just got me these uh tops because i like the feel of them i got an extra small because i like these tops to fit you know to fit my body to really shape my body and i got them in three colors i got them in white and black and then i got it in this list i don't even know what this color like a a dark i don't even know orangey tint color can i couldn't wait to try this jacket on is like distressed and it has this in the back it is so cute oh yeah so i finally get it but yes oh i love this jacket y'all this is how it looks on me and again this is a size medium because i wanted more of a like a relaxed look yeah this is something i wear to go do errands or something but it is so cute i'm trying to see if you guys can see it up close it is so cute and i like the little fringe at the bottom like very minimal this is very cute and then i got just yeah i remember that corset that white corset that i tried on i got it in a few different colors i got it in like this orange color i don't feel like trying it on but 
it's the same thing it fits the same way how the white fits and then I got a black because of course got to get everything in black and then the last thing that I got was these like fake like leather pants I'm gonna try these on for y'all but they look I brought some leather pants from Zara like a year ago and I can't find them like I think they're in my drawer in my pants drawer but I just don't go through all my drawers when I wear my pants because I have like I have my favorites but I need to check to see if the ones that I brought from Zara which again they're still fake fake um leather but I need to see because they they were really good and I brought them on sale and Zara all always be having like hit or misses with their clothes especially jeans at least for me um so yeah let me try these on for y'all all right y'all so I got the like the leather pants on and I got these in a size extra small and look I like my pants to where they could fit like you know on me without having to wear a belt so this is how it looks without a belt and it don't have no hook for a belt so I couldn't even wear one if I wanted to but they fit me so nice so good it's comfortable and I just paired it with like this uh, jean jacket that I just showed you but it looks so good like I'm gonna try to uh, get a different angle from y'all from here as well but these look so nice and you, again you see how it's not baggy right here like in the front like I don't like that these are really nice the bottoms are like you know fringe not fringe but like they come out a little bit on the bottom but still skinny that fits tight on you not super tight but yeah all right y'all so that is it for my little she and haul y'all i hope y'all enjoy this little Shein haul and if you pick up anything that i brought make sure you let me down make sure you let me know down below in the comments because again y'all don't be commenting on my videos and i don't like that <laughs> i don't so make sure y'all show me some love y'all comment y'all like and subscribe so yeah